We are out at Firestone Country Club today playing the North Course. Here's hole number one. Pipe to drive down the middle. Had a nice little easy wedge into the green. Just tugged it ahead of hair, but um, nice look at birdie here. Slid a little on the low side. Typical for me. Stay on the amateur side of it. A nice little easy tap in. Hole number two. Stand between the two bodies of water here. Get it up a little on the right side of the slope. Have it a little bit above my feet. Kind of hit a nice little pull draw on this one. Again, just a nice little easy up and down. A 60 degree chip and a putt into the hole. Have a nice dog leg to the right after I just faded my first two shots. And hit it straight into the trees. So here we are punching out. Trying to get back to the fairway. Hit a nice little bump and run on the way through. Gets back into the fairway and I have a nice little... Again, easy wedge into this shot. Tugged it. Um, I don't know how you tug it this much when you're this close to the hole, but here we are. Again, trying to save par with a nice putt and low side once again. So we tap in for bogey and we move on to the next flag in the hole. Pipe a drive here up the left-hand side, trying to go over those bunkers to have a nice easy wedge in. Um, once again, hitting wedge into this hole. Hit it up there, just a little bit of a long and left. If you uh, noticed a reoccurring pattern here, I'm always pretty much left of the hole. Trying to get one back here, and once again, uh, easy tap in par. Trying to play through this group in front of me that's waiting for me to uh, get up on the tee, so we let a driver rip, and of course we push it out to the right. Try to push it to the green, which is probably not the most educated thing to do here, so I hit a three iron, it flew more than I wanted it to, couldn't get it to cut as much, and I hit it into that bunker. Walked up with my 60 degree when the pin was in the back. So here we are chunking it, um, you know, rather short of the hole and having to hammer a putt up the hill. Once again, trying to get back to even par. And once again, here we are on the low side of the hole. We walk up, we tap it in, and we move on to the next one. Par three, hit a pretty decent shot here. Stayed at the pin for quite a while and ended up just a little bit on the left side of it. And I think we actually get a chance to roll in a birdie putt here on the long par three, which I do not birdie often. Dink, right in the bottom of the cup. No reason to take the flag out on that one. Use it as a backboard. Par five going down the hill, tug it to the left, get a very generous bounce out of the trees. It ends up staying between a couple of the trees. So what better way to ruin a good bounce than to hit driver off the deck and chase it up there to see if I can see it. And a nice little awkward jog I actually hit it into the water left of the green. So I uh, dropped, chipped up and tried to save another par. This one ends up rolling in. A little zoomed in, so a little fuzzy, but you get the gist of it. Boom. Drops in the bottom of the cup. We are still at even par. You can see the wind kind of whipping right to left on this one, so we're into this nice par three. Here I am standing in front of the flag, so you can't see it, but we start just a little bit right of the flag on this one. I thought I hammered it. It was a little bit into the wind, so it kind of knocked it down, and I look like a dumbass um, holding my club like that because I was exactly pin high and once again cannot convert a birdie putt. So we are just tapping in pars quite literally all day. Ninth hole, trying to go up the left side of number nine. You always kind of aim at this cart path. I ended up tugging it just a little bit more left of that, heading over towards one tee box. We are very close to going in these nice set of bushes that I've been in a time or two. Um, but I actually got lucky on this one and it stayed just a little bit short of them. So I actually have a shot at the green. Couldn't really see the flag, but um, trying to go basically straight over them and hit a pretty decent shot out of here. Again, wasn't really expecting much, but it ended up on the green just long of the hole. I think I had like a buck 45 in there have a chance to make another birdie putt and we sail it by on the edge and we have a nice little easy tap in coming back. Can't see me, but the ball goes in the hole and there we are with a nice even par round.